make the time sensitive decisions and then wait. If you've ever received an inheritance before, you probably already know what I'm about to say, but it's it's an emotional time. This is most often centered around the loss of a loved one, and many people simply don't want to or have the capacity to deal with all the emotional details that follow. Our message during these times like this is to focus on the immediate time sensitive stuff, like funeral arrangements, turning off social security or pensions by contacting HR or social security, or ensuring that certain assets that you inherit are handled correctly, which a good example of this would be an inherited IRA. You'll wanna make sure that you set this account up properly so to avoid a big tax bill, um, if that's the plan. Um, But after those time sensitive decisions, our advice, wait. Don't make any significant decisions until you've had time to think through it, navigate all the emotions, the exhaustion, and energy that comes with losing a loved one. This could be three months, it could be six months of time, but really there's, there's just not a timetable. It's based on your comfort level uh, of making a big decision like investing money or paying off debt or selling a home.